It's a race against the clock to save as much of Florida's reef as possible. These conservationists are moving pieces of coral to land, where they'll be safe from a blistering marine heat wave that's causing the worst bleaching event Florida has ever seen. 100% bleaching on the reefs, and we already seen at some locations 100% mortality. So it's very devastating, heartbreaking, and it's, it's, it's very threatening because we are very early into the summer of this year. So temperatures can only go up now for the next month or so. So it's going to get worse. The coral will ride out the rest of the heat wave in these cooling tanks. In mid-July, temperatures on the water's surface averaged at about 91 degrees off the lower Florida Keys, well above the average of 85 degrees. Temperatures that are not only threatening the reef, but the state as a whole. We can't afford to lose more of our reef. We're already at less than 5% live coral cover on this reef. And this reef is so important to the economy of Florida, but also to the coastal protection of Florida. The world's oceans have been record-setting hot since April. Scientists say climate change, along with the natural warming cycle of El Nino, is to blame. Currently, about 44% of the global ocean is grappling with heat waves.